If we win a hundred thousand, we'll take trend and start doing stimulants. If we win a hundred grand, I'd, I'd, I'll take five hundred dollars. Ah, he makes his up in a dose if we win a hundred grand. That's oh, not too no, bad. No. Alex Eubank has lost his mind. Just three months ago, we knew Alex as a religious guy who never used steroids because he believed they harmed the body, and that was against his moral values. He used to give advice on doing good things. Your purpose needs to be more than just yourself, right? But now, what is he doing? Gambling and promoting it with 2G to his audience, most of whom are teenagers who could get influenced and end up wasting their time and money on gambling. Oh, back up, okay! Oh, 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 no. You're a coward! No, no, no. It would've cost! You bitch! You bitch! You bitch! The big reason behind Alex change is steroids, which are making him more aggressive, making him feel more masculine and leading to a sense of dominance. This is pushing him to ignore others and do things his way, even though he knows it's wrong. Kogi. Right? Yeah. Who's not even, it's like his whole thing is like DJ and gambling, hella steroids, right? Yeah. Hey, we're in Cabo. How about it? You banks first time gambling. Yeah, bad, bad influence. Bro got me on gear, now he's getting me on gear. <laughs> From a situation, one thing is clear. We need to make good friends who help us grow positively, not ones who destroy our lives. When Alex met Toji and did the podcast, he literally said he didn't like injecting needles into his body. I remember you were talking about taking TRT. Yeah. Uh, when you were first at 200, why did you not? First, I hate needles. Like, I know that's like probably like people might think that's just like, yeah. cap. I, I don't like needles. Like, I hate getting my blood taken. Two months later, what happened? He's on HRT. But now, Toji is not only one responsible. Another reason is Alex's fame. Alex was getting less attention on social media and his YouTube views had decreased by three times. And when we get used to a high, anything less feels dull. Alex got a lot of attention in the last three years, but people get bored of him. Still, the views on his channel are a dream for many, but they were less for Alex because he got used to the high. And to get that high back, he thought about taking steroids, which is working for him now. He's getting more attention. But will this work long term? If anyone wants to maintain a presence, on social media, they need to remember that it can be taken away from them after some time, someone better will come along. This reality can't be changed. Right now, Alex might gain a few pounds of muscle, make his physique more jacked and gain fame. But then what? He's on 200 mg of testosterone per week, so his growth will stop in some time and again, people will get bored. So then what? Will he move on to trend? Or maybe heavy steroid cycles? And how long will he keep doing this? I think Alex need to ask himself these questions.